and we'll honor them here in a few minutes. Uh, the kids have worked so hard, but I would be a, a niche if I did not recognize the teachers, which we don't have all of our teachers in here tonight. Uh, Mrs. Haynes is not able to be in here, and Mrs. Shown is picking up pizza for our Master Club party tonight. Uh, so I, my wife is here, and Mrs. Carlin is here somewhere. Oh, right there. <laughs> but, uh, you know, I just, uh, I just want you to think about the Master Club work. They just put so much time, so much effort into doing and teaching their class as well. And I forgot to mention Brother Stan was here too. So. Um, anyways, since the year is ending though, I just want to remind each and every one of you, a little plug here to turn in your order forms. Uh, we'll be making our order this June on, on the evening of June 13th, just as we said in our letter, every late order uh, that we do make, though, cost us extra shipping. So please turn your stuff in on time. Now to the important part. We're going to do some Master Clubs Award. My lovely assistant is going to come up here. And this is Pitcher. This is the time you've all been waiting for. I'll tell each and every one of you about uh, one of the badges that the kids have earned. And we're going to start with our lambs, our K4, and our K5. Uh, so one of the badges that they've earned is the Three Honors Badge. This focuses on helping sharing and kindness. So the clubbers, they have to complete tasks inside the classroom that demonstrate these three traits before, that they, before they can be awarded this badge. Uh, an example might be a practice using kind words uh, or writing notes, cleaning up or taking out the trash or even sharing crowns or uh, giving up your turn to use the potty. And that is the word uh, that is used there. So our first clubber that gets awarded this one is Smith. Smith gets his helper award, his sharing award, his kindness award, his three honors award, his yellow scripture memory ribbon, and his coloring ribbon. And good job. Next one is Riley, who is not here, but she's earned. And I want to give those uh, those who aren't here just an honorable mention because this is the last award ceremony. She's not here, but she earned her helper award, her sharing award, her kindness award, her three honors award, yellow scripture memory ribbon, and her coloring ribbon. And the next one is Chevelle. Chevelle title. Chevelle is earning her helper award, her sharing award, her kindness award, her three honors award, her yellow scripture memory ribbon, and her coloring ribbon. Good job. And then honorable mention, we have Eli. He is earning his uh, uh, helper award, his sharing award, kindness award. Uh, is this Eli Hutchison, right? Okay, that's what I thought. We have a couple of Eli's. Uh, three honors, yellow scripture memory ribbon, his coloring ribbon as well. The next one is Grace. Grace, come on up, Grace. She's earning her award, her sharing award, her kindness award, her three honors award, her yellow scripture memory ribbon, and her coloring ribbon. There's just too much to get out. Oh, don't drop it all. Keep it upside down. And then we have Leo. Leo, come on up here. Leonidas. We have him earning his top award, his sharing award, his kindness award, three honors, yellow scripture memory ribbon, and his coloring ribbon. Good job, Leonidas. And that is our kindergarten, our little lamb. Oh, and, oh, Madison. Madison is also earning her helper award. Come on up, Madison. Her helper award, her sharing award, her kindness award, three honors award, yellow scripture memory ribbon, and her coloring ribbon. Good job. That is our kindergarten. So the next one is our lookout to our first grade. And one of the badges that they've earned is their Good Shepherd uh, Award, which uh, focuses on being led by God. Uh, the scripture memorization and challenges, uh, they focus on having a heart that God can use. And the clubbers learn to say yes to the Holy Spirit by being used in different ways at home and at church. And so our first clubber that's uh, earning uh, their awards is Amelia. Amelia, come on up. She's earning her good shepherd bag. Good shepherd bag. Next is Isaiah. Isaiah is earning it, also earning his good shepherd bag. And then our next one right here is Malia. Malia is earning her Sunday school attendance, master club attendance, and a good shepherd bag. 
And then we have Levi. Come on up, Levi. Levi is earning his master club attendance and his good shepherd ribbon. Good job. All right, you can go sit down. There's no ribbon there. Yeah, sorry about that. All right, and then. <laughs> All right, and then now we have our spotters. Our spotters are our second grade. Um, one of the badges that they earned is their David badge. Their David badge teaches the clubbers, it teaches them to have a heart like David had. And they have to complete challenges that emphasize friendship and leadership. And so the first one, and uh, the David badge, right? I saw David smirking over there. Um, so the first one we have here is Caitlin. Caitlin is earning her David badge, her best of the tenor badge, her sister memory ribbon too. Next we have Elijah. Elijah is earning his David badge. Then we have Leland. Leland is earning his David badge and his good servant badge. And then TJ. TJ is also earning his David badge. Next we have our third grade. Our third grade, one of the badges that they've earned is the Romans Road Badge. And it teaches them about different aspects of salvation. And they walk their way through the Romans Road and, they, and, a, and all the verses that are contained within that. And the memorization is focused on that as well. And so it's all focused on salvation. And so our first one is not here. Uh, it's Raymond. Raymond is earning his Master of Public Training. So we do have one here. We have Haley. Haley, come on up. And next, last but not least, we have our ambassadors. Now, I just want to say that I'm, I'm very proud of the ambassadors. I, I get the pleasure of teaching them. And uh, I challenged them this last month with their books. I, I, I challenged them to take them home, work on extra stuff at home so that they could get extra badges. And we had a couple, we had two or three in particular that went above and above and beyond, took stuff home. They were trying to get me in the week there. I mean, they were bugging me and that's exactly what I want to see in our ambassadors. And they did a great job. Uh, but the first one that we have, and I want to give him an honorable mention because he worked very hard, but he's on vacation, is Carter Oren. Uh, he's earning his family badge, his discovery gold badge, and his helping badge. But the next one is Autumn. Autumn, she is earning her family badge, her discovery gold badge, her discovery platinum badge, and her music award. Then we have Bobby. Bobby is earning his Life of Class 3 badge. And then he just showed me before you finish the Discovery Gold badge or a Gold badge as well. So good job. And uh, our next one is Nicholas. Nicholas is earning his Family badge and his Discovery Gold badge. Lacey. Lacey worked very hard and she is earning her Bible Study 3 badge. And then uh, our, we have David. David. Who's a teenager today if you're cheering him on? He's earning his family badge, his Discovery Gold badge, his Helping badge, and his Life of Christ 3 badge. Good job. And then we have Gideon Carlin. Gideon, he is earning his Serving My Master badge, his Scripture Memory Stakes, his Gold and Platinum Crown Pins, and his Crippled Crown Award. Good job. Let's go, Gideon! Good job, good job, good job. All right, now. Yep, you guys are ruining my thunder. <laughs> All right. So right here, now, you can go sit down. Well, I think I kind of gave that one away. Um, oh, my thing just turned off. <laughs> so funny. 
All right, so the next awards that we have, let's quiet down now. The next award we have are our special end of the year awards. We only give these out once a year, and it's our Clubber of the Year, and then our Ambassador Award. And first I'll tell you what they are. Our Clubber of the Year uh, is just, we have a point system that we do with Clubber of the Year, but honestly, about halfway through the year, it's pretty obvious who has won this award because they just, uh, it's, it's based off of bringing their Bible every week, wearing the uniform, participating, and then saying their verses before class, along with the Christian conduct. And this person really exemplified uh, those things. And then the Ambassador Award. The Ambassador Award is the highest possible award that the Ambassador can earn. And this, uh, this special and unique award is only awarded to the clubber that graduates from Master Clubs. So it can only be awarded to a sixth grader. So in order to earn this award, a clubber must have earned all four crowns, which is extremely hard. We worked three years to earn three crowns, and so they have to go above and beyond to earn the fourth crown on their own. Mm. <coughs> Excuse me. And so they have to earn all four ambassador crowns. They have to complete 16 discovery books, earn 40 merit badges, and memorize 60 scripture memory verses and display Christ-like character throughout the, their years as an ambassador. And uh, this year, that person just so happens to be the same person. Mm -hmm. And uh, you worked extremely hard, put the time in, and it paid off in the end. And everybody give it up for Gideon. This comes with several things, so come on up. You can first you want to stay up here and I want to sit down. All right, so he has this thing right here, Clubber of the Year. So hold on to your nice bag with all your treats in there. And then... These two right here are the, are the kitten kaboo. You hold that in front of me. Right here, I just want to show you guys. She gets these, he, she, he, he gets these uh, plaques right here. It says Ambassador Award, uh, 2 Corinthians 5.20. Now then, we are ambassadors for Christ. Master Club's highest honor is presented to Gideon Carlin, Landmark Baptist Church, June 6, 2018. <laughs> And then we have this other one right here. <laughs> right here, it's a triple crown award. Uh, it says the same verse, and then it says this is award is presented to Gideon Carlin, Landmark Baptist Church, June 6, 2018, triple crown award. One more thing, I want all of the sixth graders to stand there in the pulpit. Oh. All of the sixth graders come on up here, all the sixth graders. Gideon is part of that. Yeah, let's, let's He's like, no, I want to hold it. He's got really like Alright, you can come on up. <laughs> Alright, so we only have two with us today, but we have several that are graduating from us. But I just want to recognize uh, Gideon and David uh, for their years in Master Clubs. David, how many years? Two years? This is your second year? One, one year. Okay, one year. Wow, it's felt like eternity. Uh, <laughs> uh, and then Gideon, how many years? You've been in here seven years, and so he's been here the whole time I've been here. Here's just a little treat from us uh, to thank you for all the time you have. Now you get to go to the youth group. God bless you. <laughs> We have one more. Oh, you're right. I'm sorry. There's just so much. Mrs. Carlin, come on up here. Yes, you need to come on up here, Mrs. Carlin. Uh, we have uh, a person coming in and a person leaving. Uh, we have Percy Carey. She's not here right now. She's on vacation, but she's going to be taken over as our pianist for the music aspect. Mrs. Carlin is leaving us after 16, almost 16 years. She just got her 15-year award, but almost 16 years of working in master clubs. And uh, she's done such a great job. And we got you some flowers. And uh, we're... <laughs> we're really 
Can you go ahead and stand?